Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And before we get in the video, here's a few reminders. Make sure you check the description below to get all the great news and latest on everything that I've used to talk about on my YouTube channel and what I currently talk about on my YouTube channel. Also, go click the channel below and subscribe to them. They are amazing and um, they are so close to 500 subscribers. Thank you and let's get into the video. Hey guys, welcome back to another video and welcome back to Psalms 37. We skipped 36 because there wasn't really anything that I found important to talk about and it was like four verses. So we're doing 37. Pause the video and read the chapter. Now, hopefully you do that. Let's get into the notes. Verse 1 says, Do not fear the wicked. God will protect us. And that is a key part in most of the Psalms. I want to pause. Most people, there are some people, I've met one person that said that they did not get anything out of Psalms. They could not relate. And then I was like, oh, why? And they're like, they haven't experienced grief, loss, sadness, heartbreak. So why I'm, I was like, I never thought of that. Like, I, I always thought like people would get Psalms, but no. So I'm very lucky that I'm able to get so much out of the Psalms and all of that. Verse 3 says, trust the Lord and he will do good for us. When we trust him, good things happen. We don't trust him bad things happen. Pretty self-explanatory. Thanks for coming to my TED talk. Verse 4, take happiness in the Lord. 13, laugh at the enemies because their time is coming to an end. So, meaning when judgment day comes, they're not going to be going to heaven. They're going to hell. Um, experience his presence. Talk about warning. It talks about warning us about temptation and all that hard book for believers to understand i found this one really hard to understand actually but with the commentary that i have it gave me three crucial points that i really think are great points which is trust in the lord commit your ways to the lord and rest in your 